This is the Kawampi LA Basic School. Established in the year 1974, the school with a population of over 600 pupils is currently being faced with several challenges. The school located off the Kintampo Tamale Highway lacks classroom facilities after torrential rainfall ripped off the roofing of this classroom structure some seven years ago. Since then, the pupils are being forced to study under these dilapidated structures that looks like a death trap. With teachers here declining to speak to us on camera for fear of being victimized, we had to resort to some community folks who expressed worry at the school's current situation. Sofo Mustafa is one of the residents who spoke to join us. We are facing a lot of challenges as a resident of this community, even though um, we are just close to the roadside. This particular structure you are seeing here, in fact, the roofing has been taken off since 2014. And as we speak now, it still remains like that. The children don't have any place to, 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 to learn. And um, once the school has no structure of this kind, you can see that any time people are passing by or even cars are passing, it, it, it disrupts the children's studies. Pupils at the KG level in this school won't have to either sit on the floor or money to sit on this improvised wooden place, which provides temporary comfort for them. The biggest challenge, mm -hmm. we have chairs, tables, glass, <coughs> uh, teachers, books, uh, and then board that we write on. Just take a look at where they, even the, 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 the there's where the student set to learn. It's not conducive, and this cannot be happening to a community that is even just close to the roadside. Just like Mustafa, Abnuchewa, also a resident and an old student of this school, noted that the situation is worrying and will continuously affect teaching and learning in the school. Me are worried for school no hope. I formal school. I am very worried about the situation because this is my former school. After my return home, there hasn't been any improvements. Both the form ones and twos are still in separate places, and the structure is not even in good shape. The current situation, according to the people, is negatively affecting enrollment and noted that the situation won't worsen off during the rainy season. It has already affected the children's studies. Uh, some of the students uh, don't like going to school. Why? Because uh, the, the, the place is not conducive for learning. You wait. This is dry season. When it is rainy season time and you are here, you see, when a small cloud found, the children are all going to home. They have appealed to authorities to help in the roofing of this abandoned structure to save the school from total collapse. They are appealing to Kintampo Municipal Assembly and the government in general to come to our aid to help us roof this particular structure so that our children will have a conducive environment for learning. We are appealing to government and whoever can help to please come to our aid. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Kawampi.